Hi boys, just making another video. Today is Sunday, I don't know if it's the 12th or the 11th of June. Anyway, I wish that I would hear from you. It's horrible what your father is doing. Absolutely horrible. Trying to keep me away from you. It's disgusting. I would never do that to him, ever. He won't let me call you, he won't let me talk to you. He, he wants to destroy my relationship and... <sighs> anyway, it would be great if I heard from you. Don't be scared to reach out to your mother. I'm your real mother, not, not his girlfriend. <sighs> she thinks, whatever, it doesn't matter. Anyway, boys, you're my sons. You need to reach out to your mother. I've been making videos because he doesn't let me write to you. He doesn't let me call you. He tries to destroy everything. <sighs> Can you please reach out to your mother? Please? Call me, text me, reach out to me. Don't let him destroy our relationship. Don't let your father destroy your relationship with your mom. Don't let him do that. That's what he's trying to do and that's what your grandfather and your grandmother are trying to do. It's horrible, absolutely horrible. I'm one hour away and you can meet me, hang out with me anytime you want. But he's telling the court that you want nothing to do with me. Don't believe the lies, Caden and Colin and Connor. Don't believe the lies. If you want to know the truth, ask me. Don't listen to lies and don't listen to bad things about me. Don't have a heart full of hate. Have a heart full of love and caring. Remember, I'm your mother, not that woman that he has living with him. That he says had cancer five years ago and that she's not able to work. That's what he told the court. Whether it's true, whether it's not true, who knows. Can, can you please reach out to your mom? Any any parents that, that know my children, Caden and Colin and Connor Baca, Caden and Colin go to um, Tony Hinderman. How do you say it? Tony Hinderman? In um, Rio Rancho. So if you know my sons, tell them that their mother wants them to hear from them. I would never destroy his relationship the way he's doing to me. Six years of hell. Six years of hell. Six years of fighting in court. Six years of getting nowhere. Because the court believes him over me. Because his father was a police chief. Probably a corrupt police chief. Boys, reach out to your mother, okay? Know that I love you and I'll always be there for you. And don't let him do this. Caden, I know your heart. And I know how I know the person you are. Don't turn out like your father. Don't be a mean, horrible person. Be a good person. Any good parent would never hold you from having a relationship with the other parent. I li I stayed at home with you. I took care of you. Now he's trying to destroy that. He's trying to tell the court that I abused you and that I want nothing to do, or you want nothing to do with me. Don't let him do that. Caden, you know, you're better than that. Colin and Connor, remember all the pictures I used to take of you all the time? And then for the last six years, I have no pictures. Because he doesn't let me see you. He's done everything he can to hurt my relationship with you. Please listen to me. I miss you so much. My heart is broken. You know? I would never make you choose between one parent or another. I would never do that to you. And I've never made up lies about your father the way he has about me. I've never done that. My heart is broken. There's a beautiful pool where I live where you can come over and hang out be at the pool. Caden, I know how much you like to swim. 
Remember I tried to get you swimming lessons when you were younger? I would love to hear from you. It breaks my heart that I never hear from my children. He's got you so brainwashed to hate your mom and that's a horrible thing. He's got you brainwashed to think I'm a bad person, that I don't love you and I don't care about you and that I'm going to kidnap you. And it hurts my feelings when I never hear from you. It hurts my feelings when you don't reach out to me. You know? Don't let your father destroy your relationship with your mom. Don't let him do that. Because that's what he's trying to do. He's trying to make you hate me. He's trying to make you believe all these horrible things about me. Just know I love you all with all my heart. I love my sons with all my heart. And I'm doing everything I can. I don't have a support system, you know. My family live far away, you know. I moved over here for him and I stayed for my kids. I should never have stayed in the relationship. I should never have done that. I should have gone out, got out, but I didn't know at the time. I had nowhere to go. I regret staying in that relationship. I had no idea your father was capable of the things that he's done. I had no idea. Caden, he said I was harassing you because I tried to get in touch with you. This is not a joke. You might think it's funny, but it's not a funny. You don't like your feelings hurt. Well, I wouldn't. Well, I don't like my feelings hurt. You know, it's not a joke. It's really serious. Come on, let me over. of you every single day, every night, every evening, every afternoon, every time I see children your age. He's doing, if your father is doing everything he can to hurt my relationship with you. Everything he can. And he's making you believe that you can't reach out to me. He's making you believe that I don't love you and I don't care about you. And that none of that is true, Caden and Colin and Connor. I love you with all my heart. He's doing everything he can to hurt my relationship with my kids. And the court is allowing it. The court's not doing anything to stop it. You know, they don't care. You know, they just pick a side and go with it. They don't care. They're, they're tearing families apart. Every single day, they're tearing families apart. Instead of helping children, they're tearing families apart. boys reach out to your mother okay I love you with all my heart and it breaks my heart every day that I can't talk to you don't let him destroy our relationship don't let your grandparents destroy your relationship with your mom don't let them do that Caden you're better than that and don't believe all the hurtful nasty things that he's telling you don't believe them If you want to reach out to me, my phone is 505-427-2057. And if you want to email me, you can. It's gbaka07 at aol.com. I need you to reach out. It's a two-way street. I need you to reach out to your mother. And do it as soon as possible, okay? Don't let another day go by. I deserve to be in your lives. He's doing every, your father's doing everything he can to hurt my relationship with him, with, with all of my kids. Don't let him do that, Caden. Don't let him destroy our relationship. If I didn't care about you, I wouldn't stay in New Mexico. If I didn't care about you, I would have gone. I would have left and I'm still here. God, is that what are you taking up? Up. Okay, I gotta go because it's not gonna let me update. I love you boys. I love you with all my heart.